So, I'm back. Anyway, this is going to be a video where I will be talking about how to reduce your lag in the Wild West. Um, for people who really care, the reason I was gone is because I couldn't be bothered. I actually couldn't be bothered. And this video is going to be just a quick, easy thing on how to reduce lag because seriously, people complain all the time. It's pissing me off. All right. So anyway, um, for the first one, probably most of you already have this, but you're gonna wanna put your graphics to the lowest quality, which will uh, make it look like this. It's grainy, but it makes the game much more playable. Um, but something that I feel like most people don't know is this cog over here, if you click it, goes to options which can this can in turn help with um reducing your lag so the first thing you probably want to do is disable windmills all right i don't know if this really helps but like i really don't really need it and also because i like the windmills they make it look more realistic if they're just spinning so yeah i presume that helps um then this one this is a big one all right this um if you turn it off not only does it help with FPS but when you're in caves it doesn't really like this light it's almost like the cave walls are glass all right so that's that's gonna have to go off I have it off just for lighting in caves but you know because lag isn't really a problem with me the next thing is probably these two foliage sway and physics all right this for anyone who doesn't know oh my god record my keyboard sounds it's annoying keyboard sounds is um this over here it's uh I've got some foliage over here foliage sway is just like it sways in the wind and physics walk through it I presume that would help by turning them off so yeah that's something that can help also there's this thing over here called the debug info this can basically tell you how long you've been playing how much your computer is using to actually like play this game you know render FPS other stuff up here. No, uh, well this, these two are the main things of this video because you know you can just turn this down all the way to low, and this will just like get rid of the trees and won't render in trees and buildings. So you only have like a yeah, this probably difficult to have thunderstruck in logs or cactuses seen, but um. Yeah, just turn that to low. I have it on high just so I can see the scenery. And uh, rain intensity. This is the main reason for people's lag. People don't turn this off, alright? I have it on high because I like the rain. And honestly, this also turns off the snow as well in Howling Peak. But um, just turn that off. You really won't need it. And that's probably as much as you can do, really, with, you know, decreasing your lag, alright? Because this is really like my breaking point because I've had so many people complaining they're lagging they're lagging I tell them how and they're just ignoring me like my advice is horrible but this is for people who just clearly don't know um, how to turn this off all right which this can help and make your game experience much more better in turn and I plan to make some more videos soon on the Wild West I plan that when the Maxi Recode comes out, I'm going to definitely do some videos on that. And redo my old videos, because I've deleted all of them, besides Modern Mercy 3, because that game is just... Nah, I'm not. It gets, gets deleted too often, and just, the content would be boring as hell. So... That's it. Um, I would recommend waiting to I make more content for you to subscribe, so that you can see if this content is tailored to you. There are a lot of other... Um, YouTubers out here who are just as good and um, I encourage you to go see their content if this is not for you because I'll be doing review videos I'll be doing entire series on reviewing every single weapon I can and just having fun in this game and re-recording videos and uh, yeah that's, that's it so uh, enjoy not lagging <laughs>